We have satellites, radar, and all kinds of technology, but year after year, countless of people rely on a rodent for their weather forecast. So what is the deal with Groundhog Day? And how accurate are groundhogs at predicting the weather anyway? Have a guess, and we'll give you the correct answer in a minute. But first, let's get to the bottom of how this day came to be. This tradition came to North America from German settlers in Pennsylvania. In Germany, people looked to badgers to predict when spring would arrive in a celebration called Candlemas. But there are no badgers in Pennsylvania, so they went with the groundhog instead. Now this may or may not come as a surprise, but the reason the groundhog comes out has nothing to do with meteorology. It's more biology, because they've been hibernating since October. So by the time February comes around, groundhogs are getting hungry and they would also like a mate. But Canadians love Groundhog Day and the possibilities it brings. So much so that there are several local mascots like Balzac Billy, Manitoba Merv, Wyerton Willie, Fred Lamarmont, and Shubanakity Sam. So what is the success rate of groundhogs in predicting the weather? It's generally in the 30 to 40% range.